I sort of came to a realisation that there's, there's two ways of being in life. Either you work for someone or people work for you. You need to ask yourself what you really want in life. Either uh, go out there and work in a 9 to 5 job or take into my hands my own future. I'm here to immerse myself into the entrepreneurial homeland, which is the United States of America. The actual culture of the entrepreneurship is, it, it seems to be here a lot stronger than in any other country. It's just got the infrastructure ready for you to be entrepreneurial. It's no good learning it, you have to put it into practice. That's the only way you really make progress. I know how to be an engineer, I know how to be a product designer, but get me into a business arena, I don't have the experience yet, so that's where I need to be challenged. I think coming out of Europe, you can sometimes feel a little bit alone with your entrepreneurial ideas. So it's really nice to find like-minded people and uh, work closely with them. We met the first class of Global Scholars um, and that was brilliant because their enthusiasm was so overwhelming. We were like, oh my God, what do they do to them over there? They're like so ready, you know, to go. I think there are a lot of interesting uh, problems out there, a lot of business opportunities. It's really about being active and trying to change the world we're living in. What I've got out of the last six months, I think I would have spent the next six years figuring out. It's very exciting, so it's really giving me uh, inspiration and motivation to keep pushing forward. I'm revving to get back and get it, get it in motion. From someone who thinks, well, maybe there's a possibility I can do this, to someone who can actually believe, yes, I can do this and I am going to do this. And it's that belief that you need to really channel through us. And when I go back to Britain, I want to share as much as that as I possibly can and hopefully we can slowly spread the entrepreneurial spirit back in the UK. I can bring something back to my university for example where students struggle with the idea of should I go into management, should I be an entrepreneur. I could at least tell them about this experience and, and tell them that there are good chances of, of uh, building your own business. They embraced the experience so completely absorbed the lessons so deeply and thought so carefully about what implications this experience would have for them when they returned home that I think many of them experience an overall transformation in how they think about themselves, the power of their ideas, and the path that they could forge for the future. Next, I mean, what, what I really want to do is, is, is find the biggest problem in the world and, and see if I can solve it with the skill sets I have.